Injury updates and return dates for Liverpool's Thiago Alcantara, Mohamed Salah and Alexis McAllister. Liverpool will have a nearly complete squad for their upcoming Premier League match against Chelsea. After a successful FA Cup victory over Norwich City, which marked the return of Andy Robertson, Dominic Soboslai and Trent Alexander-Arnold from various periods of absence, the team is looking strong. Thiago Alcantara and Mohamed Salah are still in the recovery phase from their respective hip and hamstring injuries at the AXA training centre. This sets the stage for Jurgen Klopp to potentially field his strongest starting Sang team since October, with Kostas Tsimikas and Joe Gomez stepping in for the injured Robertson, who suffered a shoulder injury while playing for Scotland in October. As Liverpool prepares to face Chelsea on Wednesday, this marks a positive turn in the team's health, with several key players returning to the fold, Thiago Alcantara. It's been almost a year since Thiago Alcantara played a Premier League match for Liverpool, the 3-0 defeat against Wolverhampton Wanderers in early February 2023. The Spanish midfielder's season was cut short in April when it was decided that undergoing surgery to address a persistent hip issue would be the best course of action to ensure fitness for the start of the 2023-24 campaign. Nevertheless, on Friday, there were photos of the midfielder back in training with his Liverpool teammates, raising hopes that his return to action may be imminent. Anticipated return date, February Mohamed Salah. Salah's upcoming appearance will be with Liverpool following Egypt's elimination from the Africa Cup of Nations by DR Congo on Sunday. The Liverpool forward has been sidelined since sustaining a hamstring injury during Egypt's 2-2 draw with Ghana earlier this month and has recently returned to Merseyside to continue his recovery programme. Salah's advisor, Rami Abbas Issa, confirmed last week that the player's condition was more serious than initially thought and he is expected to be out of action for a period ranging from 21 to 28 days. This timeline suggests Salah's return to the Liverpool lineup will likely be in Premier League matches against either Burnley or Brentford next month. Anticipated return date, February. Alexis McAllister. Alexis McAllister is anticipated to be ready for Liverpool's Premier League encounter against Chelsea on Wednesday, despite being absent from the FA Cup victory over Norwich City. The Argentine midfielder was rested and did not participate in Sunday's 5-2 triumph, as stated by manager Jurgen Klopp. Klopp mentioned, If it were the last game of the season, a decider or whatever, he could have played but not in all games. He felt a little bit and we just said no, no, and I don't want to know more, so that's just it. We gave him a rest. I think he should be ready for Wednesday. Costas Tsimikas Tsimikas is awaiting medical clearance to make his comeback for Liverpool after spending more than a month out of action. The left-back was involved in a serious collision with Bukayo Saka during last month's 1-1 draw with Arsenal at Anfield, leading to surgery for a broken collarbone. Providing an update on the defender last week, Klopp stated, Costi is close. Costi is actually fit. He just has to wait for the green light because bone healing takes much longer, but the plate is doing the job at the moment. Anticipated return date, early February. Expect Stefan Bicetic. Bicetic has faced a challenging period in the early stages of his career with Liverpool due to various injury issues. In September, Bicetic made a comeback with appearances in the Carabao Cup and Europa League, but unfortunately, his participation against Lask Linz became his last as he encountered a calf problem. Pep Linders mentioned this week, they will not be ready for the end of this month, it will probably be going into the next month to train with us, but both no complications, progressing. Expected return date, February, Joel Matip. Matip is in the recovery phase after undergoing surgery for an anterior cruciate ligament injury. The 32-year-old, in the final months of his contract at Anfield, is expected to miss the remainder of the season. Jurgen Klopp stated, it's an ACL, ruptured, so that's what I unfortunately expected from the first second, Everything looked like that, very unfortunate. Expected return date, unknown. Ben Doak. Doak is facing a long-term absence due to a severe knee injury suffered while playing for the under-21s last month. Leanders commented on Doak's condition. That's not a good one. He tore his lateral meniscus, which needs surgery. That one will take longer time. He is young, he is a fit guy, he is a positive guy, so for sure he will come back stronger.
and we need him to come back with the same fire he has with the ball, how he was. He can take time, and we will wait for him. Expected return date, 2.30.